Watch you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can capture our desktop screen using PowerPoint now I'm using Microsoft Office 2016 and PowerPoint comes as part of that package so I'm going to open up PowerPoint here now PowerPoint is a very powerful tool which you can uh, do loads of different stuff with but we're just going to be showing you a quick way to record your desktop screen here so once you've got a PowerPoint open and a blank document open, go to insert and then go over to where it says screen recording. Click on screen recording and you'll get this little box popping up up the top. We can uh, ca capture our a pointer, capture our audio and also select an area here and then start recording. So let's go ahead and select an area. I'm going to uh, select the full screen. And uh, what we need to do here is now click on record. It will tell you uh, to push the Windows logo, Shift and Q to stop it. So here we are. I can now right click here. I can open this up. I can open this up. And we'll just do a quick recording like so. And now I'm going to push the Windows key, the Shift key and Q. And this will stop the recording. And there we go. So there it is right there. So all I need to do here now is I'll just quickly show you. I'm just going to push play and it will capture audio as well. And as you can see, pretty cool. And it's a really great way of capturing uh, your desktop. And the good thing about it is you can make changes to this as well. So you've got a load of options here. You can put borders on it if you want to, to make it nice and fancy. So it gives you the option to make uh, changes to this on the fly right here uh, by using these features up here now obviously they've got loads of different stuff inside here if you want to add a little bit more uh, style to it you can do so it's great for uh, presentations and stuff like that for uh, work and stuff like that or maybe you're doing some sort of school project uh, you can capture the screen by doing this also you've got all your shapes here and other stuff up here so you can just do whatever you like uh, with this uh, content that you've captured now how do you save this so right click on this uh, video here and you can see here save media as this will give you the option to save the media to whatever you like and save it uh, in whatever location you want to so I'm going to save this so here we have our file which we've now saved and as you can see it saved it as an mp4 file and that's 9.47 megabytes in uh, size and if I play this file, you can see you get a nice quality file and it's recording everything we've done here on the screen. Very quick and easy to do and you can do that with PowerPoint. And I'm going to just quickly check to see the file details. And you can see it's recorded that in 1920 by 1080. Very quick and easy to do guys. And that's how you can do it in PowerPoint. Anyway, I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Thanks again for watching, guys, and thanks for your continued support. I shall see you again for another video real soon. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.